hey guys welcome back to our repair guys thank you guys for watching and subscribing in today's video guys we're going to explain what piston slap sounds like how to know if it's a piston slap okay and we will also have the video fixing that I wanted with a piston slap guys uh, quite a few videos coming if you have one one of those vehicles uh, we also have BMWs, Ford's, all kind of stuff on the channel so please subscribe also please give a subscribe to our new channel Electrical Car Repair Life quite a few videos will come there as well so Hyundai Wantras guys that generation from 2011 to 2016 they're prone to engine knocks uh, even with low miles I read some people will do that with 20,000 miles on the vehicle ours had 60, it has 69 as of right now he has a, a, a piston slap and we will explain okay what we did and uh, how to know that it's a piston slap so first thing guys we change the oil right you think that it might be oil so you're hoping that it will go away after that it read that you have to use original oil filter so after that we purchased original filter from Hyundai oil filter installed it put new oil still the same thing okay now the thing about it is when the car idles you do not hear it as much listen now listen now you can hear a little bit of tick 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 but not much piston slap usually guys you can hear it when the car is under load when you give it gas like climbing especially a hill or give it gas you feel it okay so let's give it gas now and when you let off the gas it will go away Okay, let's go again, gas. Okay guys, that's a piston slap right there. How you can also diagnose those? Usually, okay, you can, what we've done, we remove the engine cover and we disconnect, we disconnect the injectors for the certain cylinders. That way, eventually the piston slap, uh, let's say piston number two, it has a slap, it has a play. When you remove the connection for injector number two, uh, you will not have uh, fuel inside the piston, so it will not have as much compression, and you will not be able to hear the, the knock so much. So that's the way to figure out. Also guys, if you start climbing a hill, okay, you give it gas, you'll be able to hear that knock even more. That's most likely uh, piston slap or uh, road bearing. Road bearing, it could be a crank, be crank bearing as well, but uh, it's really, really hard to diagnose. But piston slap, you'll be able to hear it more in the top end of the engine, more like the head. It will sound a little bit kind of like having a bad valve or a bad lifter. Uh, oh, and on the other side, if you have a if you have a, a bad rod bearing, you will, you'll be able to hear the knock on the bottom of the engine more. In our case, we definitely hear it like about right here. You can hear the knock, so it sounds like it's a valve or a lifter, but it's not. We have the video taking things apart, getting to the piston, and we'll explain more the piston slab once we remove it. So please subscribe, many more videos to come guys, and see you next time.